welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy you're here. Today we have a very exciting video that I know a lot of you guys have been long awaiting for. So I'm so excited for today to show you guys our house that Kyle and I just bought. I'm currently getting gas. We have had the busiest morning. We spent most of our morning at the title company signing our life away, signing papers, and basically getting the keys to our house, which was really exciting. As you see, we packed up the car, Kyle drove separate, his car is completely packed up, full of furniture, we have like cleaning supplies, painting supplies, because the second we can get into our house, we want to start cleaning and painting, which we'll talk all about that later. Today I'm going to show you guys just like an empty house tour and just show you guys like the floor plan and everything like that. I'm not going to show you guys like the entirety of the outside of our house just for privacy reasons but I will show you guys the inside there is absolutely nothing inside of it right now nothing she completely cleared everything out um, which it feels so small when there's no furniture you would think it'd be the opposite that it would feel like bigger and more spacious because there's nothing in there but compared to whenever we went to go see it when it was staged for showings it looked so much bigger but it's honestly the perfect size for Kyle and I it's a two bedroom technically three bedroom but one of the bedrooms we're using as like our sunroom which you guys will see two bedroom one bath which if you guys are new around here you know that we bought a house in st louis missouri so a lot of the homes in south st louis are older my brother has a home in south st louis that's like 150 years old our house is a little bit younger it's only 70 years old but these type of homes since they are older they have a lot of character which we personally loved like i love how all the houses in our neighborhood are different there's not a single one that looks like the next and it just adds so much character our neighborhood is just so cute i'm obsessed with it it just feels so homey and we've already met a couple of our neighbors and they're just so sweet we just love it we're obsessed with it it's just perfect for us in the stage of life that we're in and we just could not be any more lucky because we looked at so many houses and honestly we put in a couple offers before we got this one and looking back we feel like everything really just worked out the way it was meant to be and we we're just meant to end up with this home. This is our home and we can just feel that. So I'm so excited to show you guys it and we will be making a few changes and just adding our own style, our own touches. Like I said, we're painting the bedrooms, we're painting the kitchen cabinets, just modernizing it a little bit and just adding our own taste. But that's what's so fun about having your own house. I've only ever rented, but now that we have our own place, we can just make it our own. And I just think that's so much fun. So I'm gonna get going. <laughs> I'm literally at the gas station right now. Kyle's waiting for me back at the house, but I wanted to open up this video and just say hello to you guys and thank you for all of the support. And we can just feel like your guys' excitement um, about this whole thing and this big move. And that just means so much to us. So let's go ahead and get on in to the house tour. white 
And we just think it'll brighten up the kitchen area, just make it a little bit more bright, a little bit more airy and open. And we photoshopped a picture just to test it to see if we really liked it. And we really preferred it with white paint and then possibly changing the hardware out to black hardware. We think that would look really good, really nice. But the silver also matches the appliances. So we'll just kind of see on that. We really, really wanted a nice big kitchen. So this was a huge selling point for us. Then coming on this way, this is the third bedroom I was kind of telling you guys about, but technically it's considered a sunroom. So we are gonna keep it as a sunroom. I have a really cute idea for this room, which you guys will just have to see. I ordered some really cute kind of like summery, like coastal furniture for this room. Um, we're gonna get like a little love seat sofa with two chairs and a table, have a little bar cart in here, just an extra room for entertaining. For us, the living room is going to be more of just like cozy vibes. We're gonna sit and relax in there, but this will be where like people will come to hang out. And also a huge plus, these older homes in St. Louis, they usually have really small closets, not a lot of closet space. And we're really lucky because since they extended this house and have this sunroom, we have this whole wall of closets, which is just really nice because a lot of people have to use their basement as extra storage space. We are super, super lucky because we have a backyard for Nala Girl. We also have a two-car garage, which is like unheard of in these older homes. We wanted a backyard more than anything just for Nala to roam around. She's never had a backyard, so. Closet. The older homes have very small closets. That's why that's why we're so lucky to have that extra closet space in the room. A lot of these older homes have one bathroom, so we were kind of expecting that when we were looking down in this area, but that's okay. We'll make it work. Um, so yeah, if you look in here, we have a tub, shower, and just your typical bathroom. get an office space just to have my own space. I'll have my desk here and it'll also be nice when I can keep all my crap in here so Kyle can keep his stuff in the bathroom and in his closet and keep all just my stuff in here. I can, this is like the room I'm most excited to decorate for me. I haven't ordered anything for it really yet just because I'm not sure what all I'm going to do with this space but I can't wait to show you guys. But we are going to brighten up this space a lot um, paint the walls like a creamy white color because <laughs> I can't stand dark anything in a house. That's why we're painting the cabinets, but especially in a room that I'm going to be working in, I want it to be bright and open. So we're definitely going to paint this space. The second closet. This will be my closet. Kyle will have the master closet. And that is it. It's like I said, it's just the perfect size bedroom, one bath, but we have the sunroom for entertaining. We have a big backyard, two-car garage, which is definitely one of our favorite parts about it. And today we're going to be cleaning, painting, just like getting ready to move in. And then we're going to start moving in furniture this week. And I will be documenting the whole process of us like moving stuff in and getting our house all together and ready. But that's pretty much it. <laughs> 